Remove the four hand turned nuts under the heated bed. Remove the platform board and keep everything for future use. Loosen the belt tensioner for the Y axis. Remove both ends of the timing belt from the slider plate. Remove the passive wheel bracket of the Y-axis. Remove the slider plate from the Y-shaped rail. Remove the four POM wheels from the slider plate. Place M38 screws and M3T nuts on the linear rail, one nut per hole, with a gap of one hole between them. Secure the linear rail with the screws onto the Y-shaped rail. The distance from the Y-limit switch is approximately 10 mm. Secure the support plate onto the linear rail using M36 screws. Use M38 screws to secure the limit block, printed part, to the bracket. Place the silicone gasket above the threaded hole. Secure the slider plate to the support plate using M58 screws, making sure to first secure the side with the smaller hole. Install the Y-axis passive wheel bracket. Fix both ends of the Y-axis timing belt onto the slider plate. Adjust the tension of the timing belt properly and tighten the screws of the Y-axis passive wheel mounting bracket. Place the platform board back onto the slider plate. Then, tighten the forehand tighten nuts securely. 